and uh, yeah, the attorney general uh, they in same Dubai say sa namra sema aya two thousand and uh, the third accused Richard Jabba akwa koye no and so any any na any etigana ni amoska se fa kofa ambulances e bagana o se medi mediska no when I'm so a more decently ever about things, I will say the court of appeal decision regarding the accredited and discharge of Dr. Forsens and Richard Japa is unfair to the nation and inimical to the fight of impurity. The attorney general is going to promptly fight for an appeal. But in the same way, 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 it is idea or so how could pay appeal because I was a quite bias to know it's either so on the chest canal and I saw my call on the court somewhere and she caught a really um court of appeal release our case baby you know a picture for and all this are information way a break down a four and check her and now also the case way or she got a four buzzer or the case way what could be more or the apex court in Ghana the supreme court to see I know or the same way, I can copy over the Supreme Court. I yeah, and rather on 8th of August 2024, a whole letter about Bontin and my yeah, the Chief Justice took on the trip, took on a signature at that CIA, which are for yeah, then the stamp as she stood in the day as she said, a criminal offenses and as she said, no, which are for yes, I day above a year at a force and a Richard Japa. It is easy at the jubilation and no more woman say. Court of appeal, no, a wish for a relief on behalf of them, no, Siciano, a very year. I was on Miss Acopimo, a Supreme Court. Come home, near Cotin, and Samahodua, El Coso, about this particular ambulance trials. And Sanano, subscribe to King Two TV, like a comment, a way your comment section, we also click on the notification button for more news updates. Yet, you know, you can go to Marcia, Medas. a 2-1 split decision in favor of minority leader, former Deputy Finance Minister, Dr. Casey Latoforsen and businessman Richie Japa, yeah, a equity homo of no wrongdoing in the 2.37 million euro ambulance case. Nipa imi a file a case of no submission in that ambulance case. High Court to Botugui established a prima facie case. Emma ye di case noa. My daughter case lato force a cardio close in the case. Emma ni be general reaching the person. But now Oma de Kai a file an appeal. Ewa the court of appeal. So still ya no. Submission of no case in India. Appeal court to sign with you. So mu no boni bi Oma ye. And so so mu jina court. Na ya to 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 Oma no. And no na court of appeal no court transfer. Judge is a mi ensa court transfer. Emu mi enu. Eji tu mu se eye no kre. Omo mi we mu jina di a dance yese submission of no case ni. E wase jina. Ne high court no ye enfon suwo. Enti doctor case la to force. En a richi japa. Enfon mu hunko di. The attorney general. En ma gana fo jina te se. Kesi this is not the end of it. Obeko appeal. Na na appeal na okon. He is moving straight to the supreme court. No di asem na ko dan omo. Na wa chire adikudienti ya. En se se. The acquittal. Of Kesel at the and the Richie Japa, as I say, Eden, they hold the test of time because ruling no one so can be you know, and for so be be ever home. Now, said the bear over the case in a sea, making kind the appeal document in your chair, but said the bear over who said the case in a sea corner sea banantino may say to me was now summarize it the entire decision of the court of appeal, yeah, you two one. The obia ka yentia ni omu jina so e wuli se submission of no case no e nina na doctor case la to force en richi japa en fan hunku di en ni statementa attorney general en so e dia se ni appeals document mo no so chire se supreme court on so hwe so na sa appeals court ruling no on no so yen sete no aside se de bia be hunu se de case no e si e ko na judge for me en san omu tena se e wo de appeal case no so no e ye one Justice Kwekuti Akabwafu. Two, Justice Philip Bright Mensa. And a three, Justice Alex Poku Echampo. These were the three appeals court judges. Yeah, Omo, 
Eurulu on the submission of no case and the possible and answer the acquittal of Dr. Kese Latoforsen and Richie Japan. Judge Nia will declare here justice kweku ti akabwafo. Ninsem na wakaini nyinana mabone tofan wase. Based on my analysis and in fidelity to the law, I am of the opinion that the appeals filed by both the first and third appellants should succeed. In the result, I would allow the appeals and the ruling of the trial court dated March 30, 2023, calling on the first appellant and the third appellant to open their defense in respect of the charges in count one and count five, hereby set aside. Also, the call on the third appellant to open his defense in respect of the charge in count three, set aside. In their place, an order upholding the submission of no keys entered for both the first and third appellant in respect of those three counts in the charge sheet is issued. Consequently, both appellants are hereby acquitted and discharged. Reasons you know, for name Justice Philip Bright Dean and Epe, into Mekani Nabum, Namakanako. Now, they both made, or no, and a justice, Philip Bright Mensa, both made some conclusion, including the fact that the prosecution, which is the Attorney General, did not establish a prima facie case against Atuforsen and Richie Japa, and therefore the High Court erred by upholding the argument of the state, according to. Justice Kwekuti Akabuafu, Justice Philip Bright Mensa the Attorney General, and to me, I established a prime facie case. They rejected the case of the Attorney General that Atu Forsen issued the letters of credit without the authorization of the then Finance Minister, Sir Tekpe, noting that evidence adduced. By confessions from both Ato Forsen and Sir Tekpe indicate that his boss, Sir Tekpe, was very much aware of Ato Forsen's actions and that he, Sir Tekpe, gave Ato Forsen the permission to issue those letters of credit. And the judge informed me, you know, the other kind of attorney general, Eka said. Uh, to force an issue those letters of credit without authorization, Ukraine, according to Judge Simeon, and your sanity. And the Kodian Tomoka Sanity said, At to force in one case, the Adansia or court to say, and then the two may soon or the sign. Sansuna said, Tekpeyana or your finance minister, or no so at to force and friend as a witness, or no so be the Adansia or court to say, or no, and the man, Dr. Kessel, at to force to me, say, or issue those letters of credit. And it on what jay. You are said take us no two minutes per couple. So you cannot come to court and say that Ato Forsen acted without authorization. This is according to the two judges. If you almost say to succeed on the charge that the first accused acted without cause and authorization, the best evidence to establish it was for the prosecution to have invited the substantive minister, Honorable Sir Tekpe. Having regard to the evidence, it was done on his blind side. We are of the considered opinion that Sir Tekpe was a material witness whose evidence would have decided the case one way or the other. Failure by the prosecution to invite him to testify that he did not authorize for sin was fatal. To the case of the prosecution. For the law is well settled that if there is a vital point in issue and there is one witness whose evidence would, would settle it one way or the other, that witness is a material witness that ought to be called to offer evidence. There is that evidence on record in our present case. That in the course of investigations into the matter, 
Honorable said Tekpa is said to have volunteered a statement to investigator, prosecution witness five. In this case, that seems to suggest that the request for the establishment of the LCs was done on behalf of the Ministry of Finance. For purposes of clarity, we reproduce excerpts of the statement, that is Exhibit 5, upon receipt of the Attorney General's opinion. Ministry of Finance proceeded to establish the LC. The letter noted that this was a valid contract. By this voluntary statement to the investigator, it means that Mr. Se Tekpe was very much aware of the steps the first accused took in requesting the establishment of the LC to avert the imminent action against the government of Ghana for breach of contract. And this advice was given by the office of the Attorney General then. Now, there is no iota of evidence on record to show that if indeed the letters the first accused wrote were done on his blind side, Mr. Tepe